Moi, c'est Michel Degras. Moi, c'est un professeur linguistique dans MIT. Et puis tout, moi, c'est directeur initiative MIT Haïti. I like to think of the MIT Haiti Initiative as um, relying on, on three pillars. And those three pillars are uh, active learning as a new way to, to teach, uh, instead of having teachers and students rely on note-taking and rote learning. And also, we uh, promote the use of the native language of Haitian Creole, which for active learning is uh, essential. Uh, plus, there's been lots of research, uh, including here at MIT, that shows that the use of uh, technology, both digital technology, but also any implement that uh, allow the students and the, and the faculty to engage actively in, in the learning process, uh, improves learning gain. First of all, we develop uh, those tools, um, resources that promote active learning uh, with uh, software that we translate in Creole. We do uh, workshops. Uh, in Haiti. So we invite uh, faculty in, in STEM, in science and math. So, so far we've managed to reach about 150 institutions uh, throughout the country. Tools that, we, that we've brought to Haiti, they are easily accessible because they are, they are open access. So we have them on our website so that both teachers and students can download them on the, on the, on the laptops or the computers. Some of them now can run on, on smartphones. We've uh, collaborated now with Google so Google has access to our grocery, and Google is incorporating these new terms in the translation module. See, at first, when we're translating materials from English to, to, to Creole, many of these terms in English, they could not translate into Creole because Google didn't have the right glossary to, to, for the translation into Creole for, for STEM. But now that we've shared our glossary, we have the, the resources to do better translation of scientific materials. And so that's another way to share these new terms. Because one thing that, we, that we've been told, and which is clear uh, from my own experience, is that there is very little uh, materials in Creole for science and math. So there is a, a need for that, to create more materials. So there are two we're hoping that we can co-create these materials. But eventually, we would want uh, for Haitian faculty themselves to be engaged in this process of creating more materials in Creole. <laughs>